This is the story of a man named Stanley. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. It's bucket time. You see, Stanley, I've been reflecting on the Stanley Parable and about how roundly disappointing this ultra-deluxe version has turned out to be. The original Stanley Parable was a landmark, and any new content for it should live up to that legacy. So forget this ultra-deluxe nonsense. I say we take it one step even further. Which is why I'm very proud to announce for the first time ever the Stanley Parable 2. Yes, you see, isn't this far superior to a measly re-release with a few minor additions? Think of all the new territory we'll cover with a fully-fledged sequel. An entirely new experience, built from the ground up. Why there are so many possibilities, it could go in so many different directions. This is what fans have truly been asking for. Now, to be clear, I haven't quite nailed down what exactly the Stanley Parable 2 is going to be, but let's take a look at some of the features I've been developing for it. I figure that if I can loosely organize a handful of interesting concepts, that surely the game will sort of naturally spring up around them. It'll all work itself out. Game development is much more of a fuzzy magic than anything scientific or logical, really. Here we are. Go on. Try out some of the new features. Wait, there are two buckets here. How did you get a second bucket? Oh no, the warmth and comfort of a single bucket is already so great, so intoxicatingly wonderful. With two buckets, there's no telling. Stanley, can you still hear me? Are you with me? Stanley! Oh, thank God, I didn't lose you. Stanley, the power of two buckets was too much. I had to destroy both of them. I know how much the bucket meant to you, but I couldn't take the risk. I hope one day, you can forgive me. 